Bob aboard Portland's new tram. Get ready to pay for the privilege unless you work at OHSU. Tomorrow, the city council will vote on whether to raise the cost of a round-trip ride to $4 for the public. Supporters say that amount will help pay for the big cost of the project, which went more than $40 million over budget. KPTV's David Freitas is live in southwest Portland tonight with more. David? Well, when the tram was first proposed, the cost of a ticket to ride it was supposed to be the same as a two-zone ticket on TriMet, about a buck seventy. Now that cost, as you said, has more than doubled. It's a frustration for some who say the public has already paid enough. Tonight, doctors and employees of OHSU climb aboard for a high-flying commute to work. Just minutes from now, they'll be at the top of Markham Hill and avoid the jam on the highways and roads to OHSU. It's almost impossible to park up on the hill. For employees like Cameron Brick, it saves them the agony of a bike ride up Hill Hill. It's easy to ride, it's pretty fast, and obviously free for those of us who are employees. But it won't be free for the general public. A new proposal calls for anyone but OHSU employees to pay four bucks for a six-minute round trip, about 65 cents a minute. Yeah, I'm not going to be on going on that thing. That's more expensive. Expensive has been a buzzword around this entire project, which went from an estimated $15 million to a final cost of $57 million. That's why supporters say the cost of a ride for the public also needs to go up. I do think there needs to be some clarification about exactly what was agreed to, because if we're paying for it, it should be part of the transit system. And Portlanders are paying for a portion of the tram, about $8.5 million over time, or about 16 bucks for every man, woman, and child that lives in the Rose City. The cost of four proposed round-trip tickets, okay with some. I gotta pay for it somehow. It disturbs me a little bit that it seems to be for a very select few. I'm now, OHSU, OHSU and its partners will actually pay about $49 million of the $57 million price tag. They say it is a critical link between the campus you see up on Markham Hill and this camp, new campus down here on the riverfront. But this was touted as it was proposed to be part of the mass transit system. That was at least the initial proposal. And now this new price tag to ride the tram has some concern. Live in Southwest Portland, David Freitas, the 10 o'clock news.